responder to him repeatedly to keep his guards up. Kung ating babalikan ang pinakamalaking panalo at pinakamalaking balita noong 2014, ay iyon atang laban ng dahitman ng Dabao del Sur na si Ray Loreto kontra sa South African fighter na si Nakoshinati Joye. Sa laban nga na ito mga bay, ay napanaluna ng Pinoy ang bakanting IBO World Light Fly title sa pamamagitan ng isang upset win at makalipas nga ang isang taon ay naghamon ang South Africa para sa isang rematch at dito nga ay naloko ang kampo ng Pinoy matapos hindi ibigay ng South African promoter ang premyong nagkakahalagang 42,000 US dollar o mahigit 2 milyong peso. Ang unang laban na naganap noong Pebrero 1 taong 2014 ay sa bansang Monte Carlo, Monaco na kung saan ang ating kababayan na si Ray Hitman Loreto ay may kartadang 17 wins with 9 knockouts at may 13 na talo. Habang ang South African na si Joye ay may kartadang 24 wins with 17 knockouts at may dalawang talo. Dahan-dahan ang pagsisimula ng laban sa round 1 mga bay, habang sinusubukang alamin ng dalawa kung ano ang taglay na lakas ng kanilang kalaban. At bago naman matapos ang round 2 ay munti ka ng bumagsak si Joye nang tamaan ito ng right uppercut sa panga at na-save by the bell. Hanggang sa round 3 ay ipinagpatuloy ng Pinoy ang pag-atake at tinapos ang laban. It's a battle of the South Pole. It is well known in boxing that sometimes these fights can get less interesting, sometimes these fights suddenly. Yeah, it's a strange situation, Bumrani, because you got two guys so that uh, tend to stand on each other's feet business. Loretta has been a... He came on well. He's like a good red wine on Kusinati Joy. I mean, he's, he's 30 years old now. Look and see why he's a two-time world champion. Lost, of course, in that title fight to Eki Badley in South Africa. But to look at their records, you see that Joy himself also has been stopped. Round number seven out in a Mexico, stopped by... Mario Rodriguez, that's why he lost that uh, and has had some great victories coming to this fight. Of course, he beat Benazar Alaloid at the Emperor's Palace, stopping him in round number nine at the Palace in South Africa as we come to the end of round one. I've just done that as we go into round number two for this vacant title. Two South Poles, Loreto from the Philippines, Joy from uh, South Africa. Boxing as he kept him going to the gym, carrying someone's bag, and then they said, Okay, you're gonna fight Amit. And a fighter of note as he bent that body with the right hand. Reto, the hitman, as his nickname, I'm sure he's gonna want that title as well. But he's got his hands full here with Mahobi. Because a naughty joy from South Africa. It's Joy who is taking the fight to Loreto. He's trying to establish the rhythm and just the range, the distance with that right hand jab. Well, Loreto has felt that power to the body. Nice stuff, Ed Sahim, the trainer shouting from the corner up and down. That's exactly what he did. Oh, the start by the right hand. Oh, look at the end of the move. Ed head right now. Step on the floor. He's doing the same for Big Ten. Literally saved by the band. Pag masagit na, ha? Sagit na. Pag jab, kalibu pa lang kayo kanwiti, ha? Pag jab, boom, boom, ha mo? Ray Lorenzo's corner, Joe Jordan, the trainer, and Rika Santi, the manager of the man. Okay. Can I take a gadget in the bag? Come on. Come on. Can I take a gadget in the bag? Let's watch the replay. Here comes the left hand over the top, right hand. Boom! Big left hand on the button. Catches Joy. Boom! Another left hand. 
Right hand, left hand, on. and he was definitely saved by the bell. And here comes uh, Ray Loretta. Loretta wants to finish it off right now. It is still remains a mystery. Does Joy have his legs back? It's going to be seen in this, the third round. Loretta still piling on the pressure. Joy trying to establish the left jab. Joy is also quite a decent puncher too. He's dropped his guard. His corner told him repeatedly to keep his guards up. Isang taon makalipas ay naikasa ang kanilang rematch at nakatakda sana noong February 28, 2015. Ngunit naoperahan ng appendicitis si Ray Loreto noong February 6 kaya namove ang petsa ng laban ng Marso 22. Ito ay 45 days para maghilom ang sugat ni Loreto mula sa operasyon. Isa itong napakadelikadong laban ng Pinoy, ngunit tinanggap pa rin ni Ray ang oportunidad para daw maipapagawa niya ng bahay ang kanyang pamilya. Ngunit dito rin pala sila ay maluloko ng isang South African promoter na si Shipato Handi. Sa Wayne pa lang ay nagpatawag ng emergency meeting itong South African promoter at kasama si Manny Pinyol bilang manager at promoter ni Ray at iba pang matataas na opisyal ng IBO at South Africa ay gumawa ng promissory note si Handy at permado ng lahat ng opisyal doon na madelay daw ang premyo ng Pinoy. Para sa buong kwento ng kontrobersiya na ito ay bisitahin po ang link na nasa description ng video natin. At isang himala nga mga bay, nang manakout ni Ray Loreto si Joy Yee, ilang segundo lang ang nakalipas sa round 1. Halata din sa lahat ng manonood ang disappointment nila sa kanilang pambato na natalo agad sa laban. Anim na taon na ang nakalipas mga bay ay hindi pa rin nababayaran ang ating kababayan mula sa premyo niyang dalawang milyon na sana pero naging bato pa. Hanggang dito na lang mga bay, kung nagustuhan niyo po ang ating video ay pakipindot naman ang like at subscribe button. Nag-upload po tayo ng video isa o higit pa kada linggo. Maraming salamat!